All right, quick little video of uh, out in the backyard. A nice cool night. Feels great out here. The little golf thing is a. Uh, if I get a better shot of that. It's really fun to play. It might not look like it, but it's 11 feet long. I'm gonna grab the putter. I'll see if I can do this one handed. So the way it works is you hit the ball and you try to go in one of the little cups down there. Not like that. Alright. Okay, so there I made one in the cup. And then somebody would be standing down there. And then you take these little things. Take the ball out and then you put this in. And then the first one to complete all these wins. Very simple. Or you can just you can just uh, shoot it, just play it back and forth. And then these things get out of the shadow are uh, basically like horseshoes. You got one there and one there. And they, to me, they seem hard to do, but you can play horseshoes. And then uh, over here, she's got this little ring toss thing, which is fun. Um, you, you both play at the same time, and every time that you make one, every time that you make one, you move this little thing over. And so you might be over to here, you got one more to go, and then boom, they get one, and then they get another one. And it's, uh, it's fun. I made it, I, uh, I made, I bent these out a little bit so it's easier to play. Otherwise it was stupid hard and you didn't want to play. And then over here I've got one of the big ones. So here's got an arm. It goes down, it's got a score, scoreboard. Um, let's see, it says... Each player has five swings, scores one point per hook. First one to 21 wins. And then I bent I bent this hook out too, because it was really, really hard. And I still can't play this thing with a darn. Let's see if I can make one. Oh, it's so hard. I'm, I'm watching the screen. Nope. There, I did one. Yay. And then when you're ready to, uh, when you don't want to play, you take uh, this off, press this button. Try to do this with one hand. There. Press the button, and then this folds down out of the way. That's what it looks like. I'll fold it up. This area over here I haven't done anything with. It's pretty big. Probably 30 feet long. And then uh, so little little cool little lights that look like they're fire. But they're not. And then uh, this is my old table. I've had it for a long time. I just sanded it down and oiled it. These swivel. These chairs actually go to that table, but those chairs are a little bit too tall for this table. Let's see, and then there's a fridge there. This is uh, trash. And then under here, you got a place to put all your stuff. There's a, one of those beanbag throw, you throw the beanbag thing game let's see and these chairs are fantastic these chairs are absolutely great to uh, sit in they're super comfy fire pit there these chairs are nice these chairs actually rock and swivel very comfortable couch over there fire pit and then the uh, grill. 
huge shed. I'll show you the inside of the shed. Big, big shed. And then this is all storage area, RV parking. Um, that's a 20 foot trailer by eight and a half. I could fit two of them in there and still have this whole area here. This is just nothing but stuff from the move. Can't really see in here, but it's uh it's got a ton of ton of space to put a ton of stuff. All my tires and stuff. I know it's not bright in here, but it's really nice having all this storage. And I love having all of this area. Speckles goes and runs out here. I don't know where she's at. But anyhow, this is the back area. Super nice out tonight. And a couple little signs. It's piped. You could, you could put a TV up there if you wanted to, but I chose not to. Little fridge and then that's it. that grill has a natural gas hookup so you don't ever have to mess with propane and that's about it quick little video of the back area see ya